Welcome to Landrianc on YouTube, here to help you break through those fears and live an awesome life. I am in the hills of Tennessee, a beautiful, very gorgeous remote area, um, staying at a very, very beautiful home, a friend of mine. And I want to talk today about creating your reality. Um, as you can see, it's just stunningly beautiful here. I'll take you on a tour in a moment. You can hear the birds and just how peaceful it is. That's water in the pool that's flowing right now. And I got up at 5 o'clock this morning, meditated, and watched the sunrise. Took some pictures, and if you're on my Facebook page, I posted them there. And I have to tell you, everybody needs a break once in a while, but I want to talk today about creating that reality. And I want to ask you what you're creating. When you see this, and I'm going to take you on a tour, and you could probably go, wow, that's just so what I need. My question to you is, when you see things that you desire, situations that you desire, are you, are you thinking, oh, I'll create that next? That's a great idea. Or are you thinking, oh, wow, I need that. That's what I want. And it seems like something far out of your reach or not really possible. Well, that is a story you're creating, and that story manifests. So I hope I'm not too foggy here. Um, I uh, came out of the air conditioning, and I think my, my uh, lens here is fogging up, so hopefully you can see me. But um, I just want to just tell you that, you know, and I really emphasize quantum physics all the time because quantum physics is not a theory. It's real. In fact, no final result is in place until the last split second that you decide. So if you have a negative thought or you have a disbelieving thought, you can change it and that reality will change. It's not like it's in stone and that's it or whatever reality you have created right now is it. It's always changeable. Always. You can always switch realities and you can always change your mind, literally. So I guess my question to you is when you see things, like when you see this and you go, wow, man, I would really love that, or you think that maybe I'm lucky, there's no luck involved in the things that manifest in your life. Everything is for a reason, even the painful situations, their growth opportunities, everything is an opportunity. What are you doing with all of it? How are you looking at your life? Are you thinking, oh, I need this, I don't have that, or I'm unlucky, or I'm a victim? Or are you constantly focusing on really controlling those thoughts and that reality that you are creating at every moment? Ask yourself right now, was that thought a positive one that will create what I desire? Or was it a negative one that's pushing what I desire further away? Most of us are pushing our desired realities away. We look at them as something that we want that is not possible for us. So my question is, what are you going to do about that? You have to be conscious of every thought. You have to believe that whatever it is you envision that somebody else has is possible for you. And all the things that I've created in my life have come because I've taken action. I've believed that they were possible. I never questioned that. And I move forward on it. I take the actions because you're here for the journey and so many of you want to just manifest the stuff. It's not about manifesting the stuff. You're always doing that. It's about the journey along the way and what you're creating to that place, that relationship, that job, that income that you want. It's the triumph and the beautiful things that you create to get there and, and who you affect along the way in a positive way. Because it's not always just about us. We are one entity. We're sharing this energy. It's so important for all of us to clean up our own thoughts and desires. So what are yours right now? Is everything that you want something that you think is just a vision that's not really possible? Or is it your next goal? I'm going to do that. I'm going to be in a beautiful place in the middle of the mountains, you know, having a great time. Yeah, I'm going to, you know, move to a different country. Or I'm going to get that position that seems impossible right now, but I know it's not because nothing's impossible. How many people have you seen 
do the impossible. So many of the people that we admire have done the impossible. None of these things have been handed to them. So I just want you to realize that you are creating your reality. And if you look at all these things I'm going to show you right now and you think, oh, I want that life. Is that thought one of disempowerment or, you know, desire for something, again, that you believe is not possible for you? Then it's time to start visioning what that life is, not always having to have the answers about how it comes to you. The universe will deliver it. And taking the action, and it won't happen if you continue the same patterns and thoughts that you're doing right now that are keeping you in a place that you may not desire. Even if you have all the beautiful things in the world, if you are not changing your thoughts into something higher, then no thing is going to make you happy. No job, no money is going to make you happy. It is about that journey, so make it a good one. Make it a positive one. Share with other people and just basically, you know, live that awesome life. When you believe that you have the control over how you create your reality, then we will break through fear. There will be no fear because you will have a belief system that you know is yours to create anything you desire. And there's no fear behind that. It's just, how will I get there? What next? Oh, what exciting thing is going to happen? What challenge is going to occur that's going to allow me to be the person that I know I can be, to be the better person, to accomplish the goals. What's going to happen next? And everything you're going to embrace in your life instead of look at yourself as a victim or somebody that is powerless. There's nobody above or below you. You're whole and perfect, strong and powerful, loving, harmonious and happy. Blessings, my friend. Let's go on a quick tour right now.